This video describes how to find and replace the rotary dial UniController trackpad on Raymarine Wide Screen Series multifunction displays. These rotary dials were used on both the C-Series display units, which had a black central disc in the dial, and on the newer E-Series units, which had a gray or silver central disc. The gray and black dials are identical in operation except for the color of the central disc. Unfortunately, the central flexible membrane on the Raymarine original dials have begun to rot and leak water and or completely fall off the unit. The dials are no longer available from Raymarine as original equipment, nor are they available anywhere in the world, and the displays are useless without them. Fortunately, i3D Gear Marine devoted six months of research and development to develop a new 3D printed replacement for the entire dial, the clear plastic actuators, and even the red power button cover. All are available on our website at i3dgear.com. These new dials are stronger than the originals and will bring new life to your display units for many years to come. At this point, I want to make a note about scam websites you may find which purport to sell this product. There are a few of these sites, all looking very convincing and very similar, and all offer the dials at ridiculous low prices. Note they have simply stolen the images and description from our eBay product listing, as with thousands of other eBay product listings. Please be assured we do not supply to any of these sellers, and you will not receive a dial if you order from them. The purpose of these sites is only to steal your credit card information, and shortly after ordering, your credit card company will inform you of fraudulent charges being placed on your card. So enough about that warning, let's get into actually replacing the dial. The dials come with detailed instructions. You can replace the dial without removing your display from your Helm dashboard. Start by removing the display bezel. Note the bezels are very fragile and care must be taken not to crack them while removing them. Start from a corner with a flat object like a kitchen knife or a wide screwdriver. Carefully pry up the corner until it pops and releases. Work your way down the side to the next corner and carefully pry that up. Continue around the display unit until the bezel pops off. Remove the two small screws holding the dial in place and pull the old dial out. If you are also replacing the clear button actuators below the dial, Pull the old ones out with tweezers or needle nose pliers. Assemble the new actuators as shown in the instructions and simply pop them into the new hole with the keys on the side aligned with the slots inside. Remove your new dial from its box and carefully slide it into the hole, aligning its keys as you do so. It should go in with little or no effort or force. Replace the two screws and test the dial to make sure it works properly. Replace your bezel by snapping it back on carefully and you're ready to enjoy many years of use out of your widescreen display unit. Contact i3D Gear Marine on the contact tab of our website if you require any information or simply place your order by clicking on the order tab. Shipping is free worldwide and all our products are guaranteed.